Hey guys, it's Melina. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me to film another video. I'm doing a vlog today. I'm filming this get ready with me. And then after this get ready with me, I'm filming a playlist video. So I have a lot of content. Today is Sunday, December 6th. So we are almost a week into Vlogmas when I am filming this video. Obviously this will be up later, but I'm trying to get on my grind today because I have school tomorrow and I'll have less time to film and edit and upload. So I want to stay consistent. So I'm going to stop rambling. I'm going to start with my brows. I think it's boring to watch like people do their brows consistently um, unless it's a brow tutorial. So I'm just going to show you guys what I'm using. I'm using the LA Girls Shady Slim brow pencil and then I have the ColourPop Brow Boss Gel the clear one. My brows are done so I think I'm going to do my eyeshadow. It depends. I usually do my brows first but sometimes I put on like my base makeup and then do my eyeshadow. Sometimes I do my eyeshadow first and then do my base makeup so it changes by the day but I think I'm going to do my eyeshadow first just because I'm really anticipating it. I'm using the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer in fair beige and I'm just using this instead of like an eyeshadow primer because I like how this has pigment in it and it really covers up like my veins and the coloration and or the discoloration in my eyelids so I'm just gonna use this. I have the concealer on and I need to turn the brightness down but I have you guys zoomed in so I can show you guys what I'm doing for eyeshadow which I don't even know what I really want to do for eyeshadow today so we're just gonna go with the flow. I think I'm gonna use the Jeffree Star palette first. I know Jeffree Star is canceled. I say this in every video. I use this palette. He already got my money. I'm not gonna destroy a palette that he already got my money for, but if you have this palette, then that's great, but I'd not suggest buying it now. Um, I got this before he got canceled, but whatever. Um, I'm going to use Wake and Bake, which is this like green shade down here all of these shade and I'm going to use that in my crease this is what it looks like I'm going to use this like flat but like it's flat but it's like kind of fluffy yes it, um, almost all my brushes have old eyeshadow on them that I need to wash but it's whatever um, I'm going to use this like really bright green and it's called neat I'm going to put that in the crease but like not as transition, we're gonna really deepen it up with Nate. So if you can't tell, I just kind of like put it in the crease and then like haven't blended it out yet. So I'm just gonna use more of that like this shade Wake and Bake and I'm just gonna blend the deeper green out. I just blended the green out and I'm gonna go into the Too Faced. This is the 2019 Christmas Collection set palette. And I've been dying to use this one shade, and the, I, this is, the shade is the reason I did this look. Um, but it's called Drink Up Grinches, and it's literally this deep green emerald shimmer. And so I'm gonna put that, like, on the outer V. I think I'm gonna wet my brush first. Like, even when I swatch this, like, there's a lot, whew, a lot of pigment, but I really want it to be, like, in your face. Wait, let's get this moment on camera not and have me lean out of the <gasps> that is so pretty it's so pretty it's literally perfect oh my gosh I think I might need to deepen up the green uh, like in the crease and like the outer V so this doesn't look so out of place but I'll come back and I'll do both eyes and I'll be back okay so this is what it looks like it looks really funky so I'm gonna find there's a certain brush I'm looking for. It might be dirty, I'm gonna be honest. So, you might just have to use a different brush. Actually, this is not the brush I wanted, but we're gonna try to use this and we're gonna find like a really deep green that I can like try to blend this out with. My Morphe 35B palette is practically falling apart, but I'm gonna use, there's like no shade names on this. So, I'm just gonna use this really deep green right there. And I'm just gonna use this Morphe M562 brush and I'm just gonna really deepen up that crease and especially the outer V and I'll be back. Um, I'm also going to use this bigger fluffy brush with a bit more of this like the transition shade. What was the transition shade called? 
the Wake and Bake from the Morphe X Trophy Star Palette, and I'm gonna blend that out so it doesn't look as harsh. So I literally took the brush, took it like halfway to my crease, and then just did the outer V, and now I'm gonna blend this all out with this Wet n Wild crease brush and a bit of that Wake and Bake shade. It's a bit more blended. This one is like going way down, so I'm gonna fix that. But like once I do my concealer and all that good stuff, so I'm gonna use Get Elf Up from the Too Faced from the Too Faced palette, and I'm just gonna put that on my finger and put it on the. Oh my gosh, <sighs> this is what it needed—the center of the lid. And then I want the brightest shade to like be in the center, so I'm just gonna swatch two shades from the Jeffree Star palette. Oh my god, I love this one shade. It's called Custom Rims and it's like literally pure silver and it's the best. And then there's Welcome, which is like a white. It looks pink because I've used like other shades. I think I wanna use this one, which is Welcome. So I'm gonna put that on the inner part of my lid and I think we're gonna be almost done with the eyes. This is what the eyes look like. There's like, the shimmer on the lid. I love the Drink Up Grinches shade. I like all these shades together. They look, I think they look very good. So I'm going to finish up my base makeup and I guess I'll just show you guys what products I'm gonna use but I'm gonna zoom you out first. I'm gonna go back in with the camo concealer and kind of clean up where there's like, where I blended a little too far down. It's kind of refocusing, but I made it a lot more sharp with the concealer, and I love how it looks, so I'm gonna go in with the Makeup Revolution London Conceal and Define Full Coverage Foundation. Okay, um, I did like my concealer and foundation, and I just used the same e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer, and I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Dolce de Leche, and use like the highlight shade. I call it a setting powder, and I'm gonna set my face with that, and then I'm gonna use the bronzer. I'm going to use the Milani Romantic Rose blush. I know I've literally used three other eyeshadow palettes in this look, but I'm using a fourth one. I'm using the highlight from the James Morphe X James Charles palette. It's called Face. I've hit Pam on it, but I'm going to use that one. For lashes, I'm just going to use the Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. And for lips, I'm literally just going to put on Carmex. This is the Fresh Cherry because the regular Carmex smells awful, so I like the fruity ones or the flavored ones. That is it for the look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!